Here's the final minutes for you. While he's doing shit like this. The man cannot stop talking about Donald Trump. Cannot ever stop talking about Donald Trump. Despite the fact that Trump is no longer president. Despite the fact that Trump has been banned on all social media platforms. Despite the fact that hypocritic cocksucker Mark Hamill back in October said, I'm counting the days till this election's over. So, uh, cocksucker Mark Hamill. You don't call Mark Hamill a cocksucker. I'm sorry. You don't call Mark Hamill a cocksucker. You just don't do it. Now, I admit, he is kind of a troll. He does like to post shit just to get people aggravated. And he is very left-winging like most of his Hollywood friends. And he does go on too much with that, like, God damn, I'm tired of hearing about this shit. But you don't call him a cocksucker. You unfollow him or you say, man, I don't know. But you, I don't understand how anybody, and of course the other fan on Menace Channel is not going to call him out. I asked uh, Echo Beast. They always say they're part of the Phantom Menace. So what y'all think about it? Oh, I'm not, I'm going to let him speak his mind. You know, I don't got nothing to say. If it was in, you know, if Kathleen Kennedy said that Gate, Gate the Gamer Kid was a cocksucker, they would all be making videos about how toxic it is. I'm sorry. I draw the line and making fun of Mark Hamill. Cocksucker Mark Hamill. That's Ryan. I'll talk to Ryan. I like Ryan. Thought, come on. You got to be called out for that. Mark Hamill has been kind of a... Yes, that's who he is. That's his character, though. You don't call him a dick. I mean, he, he does stuff to push buttons, sure. And he is kind of a dick sometimes. But just you don't just because he has a different opinion as me or you or somebody else, I wouldn't call him a cocksucker. Jump man <laughs> channel popping, though. Thank you, sir, for that unsolicited testimony. <laughs> <laughs> 